Hey guys, I wanted to do the weekly news from a slightly different space. Uh, I'm up here, as you can see, in the foothills of uh, the top of Sierra Madre, uh, taking some time out as we prepare for Easter to pray, to listen to the Lord. And uh, as I arrived here this morning, I was just greeted almost immediately by the image that's over my shoulder, which is um, the sun shining down on the center of Pasadena, if you can see it in the distance. And I just felt the Lord speak to me uh, something and remind me of something that I wanted to share with you. Um, here at Vintage, we have, we have four values. Uh, our values are that we want to be a church of word and spirit. We want to be a church that has great intimacy with God in our prayer and our worship, our encounter with him. We want to be a, church, be a church that feels like a great family, but also we want to be a church that reaches out with the love of Jesus to the hurt, the lost, the lonely, the least um, of our city. And as I got here this morning, as I was just greeted by this beautiful sight over my shoulder, I was just reminded of, of a prophetic word that was given to Laura and I before uh, we started Vintage Pasadena, which was uh, that we are called to, to serve and love and be family to the, the city, but also we're, we're called to be people of influence who care for and pray for the prosperity and uh, the, the good of the city. And uh, I was reminded of that this morning in, in the book of Jeremiah, when the people of God are uh, in exile, the word of God comes to Jeremiah. And God says through Jeremiah, you know, seek the prosperity of the city, because as you seek the prosperity of the city, uh, to you will you will flourish. And uh, I just felt that call again on my life this morning to to kind of lay down my life to serve, to bless, to bring the good news of Jesus to the city of Pasadena and the surrounding cities. Um, and I know a bunch of us have that kind of calling on our life. Um, so as we prepare for Easter, I just want to bless you and encourage you uh, with that. I want to ask you the question, what does it look like for you today to seek the prosperity, to seek the good, to serve, to bring the good news of Jesus to uh, your neighborhoods, to bring it to your neighbors, to bring it to your workplaces, to your schools? Um, to be the places that you will be today. Um, and one way you might want to think about doing that as we get ready for uh, Easter weekend, where we're going to have baptisms, we're going to have dedications, we're going to have a sunrise service, we're going to have an Easter egg, hunt, Easter egg hunt, we're going to have a Good Friday um, reflection, is, is just really to ask this, who, who would the Lord uh, put on your heart to bring along uh, to one of those services um, to hear the good news of Jesus this Easter time? So uh, we love you, I'm praying for you today, uh, every single one of you, and look forward to seeing you at the weekend.